And the cornerstone of the Islamic faith is the belief in one and only soul, creator and sustainer of the entire universe. He alone deserves worship. And it is because of belief in one God that there can be universal brotherhood. That means the same God has created all the human beings, irrespective whether they are rich or poor, whether male or female, whether black or white, whichever caste, color, creed you belong to, all of them are equal because you are created by one and only sole creator, Almighty God. Only if you believe in one God can you practice universal brotherhood. That's the reason that all the major religions which believe in the concept of God, on a higher level, they believe in the existence of one almighty God. And according to Oxford Dictionary, religion means a belief in a superhuman controlling power, a God or gods that deserve worship and obedience. So in short, if you want to analyze any religion, you have to understand the concept of God in that religion. And the best way to analyze the concept of God in any religion is not by looking at what the followers are doing, because many of the followers themselves do not know what the religious scriptures speak about Almighty God. The best way is to analyze what the scripture of that religion has to speak about Almighty God. And the glorious Quran says in Surah Al Imran, chapter number 3, verse number 64, Kul, ya ahl al kitab, say, O people of the book, ta'ala wila kalmitin sawa'in, bainan bainakum, that come to common terms as between us and you. Which is the first term? Allah na'buda illallah, that we worship none but Allah. Wala nushrika bihi shayyaw, that we associate no partners with Him. Wala yattakhida baaduna baadan arbaban minun illa that we erect not among ourselves lords and patrons other than Allah. Fain tawallahu. If then they turn back. Fakulu shadu. Say ye bear witness. Bianna muslimun. That we are Muslims bowing our will to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah shows you a way how to speak with different people. It says, Ta'ala wila kalmitin sawa'im. Bainana bainakum. That come to common terms as between us and you. Which is the first term? Allah na'buda illallah. That we worship none but Allah. Wala nushrika bihi shayyaw, that we associate the partners with him. So in order to understand the concept of God in any religion, you have to understand what that scripture has to speak about Almighty God. If you understand the concept of God, you will understand the religion.